With deep tech, there is the opportunity to do good and do well. My name is Lim Jui. I'm the CEO of SG Innovate, which is a wholly owned venture capital company of the Singapore government. Deep tech is something that demands a high degree of specialization from both the inventor as well as the practitioner. On a working level, that usually means something that has come out of relatively recent research and has the potential for intellectual property protection. And it's context sensitive, time sensitive. So what is deep tech today isn't going to be deep tech in five or six years, depending on what we're talking about. Singapore is to invest 25 billion Singapore dollars in a research. into research over the next five years to address a broader spectrum of national needs. The amount of money that has been pumped into deep tech. I mean, if we just look at the what are known as the research innovation enterprise five year plans. I mean, that's basically money that goes into deep tech. We're going to move into new areas. We're going to move into biomed. We're going to move into agri food and we're going to move into advanced manufacturing. We're going to define themes within those areas. Uh, that we think are investable and we intend to start making investments in them. Our mandate is to look at early stage frontier technologies. We feed at the bleeding edge level. We provide the initial capital, we provide the due diligence so that other investors who may have reservations about doing it can join us. So we were early investors in AI. Uh, we were early investors in quantum. That's a tough call. I mean, that takes courage. When I was at NTU, I used to tell PhDs, look, there are more of you than there are jobs in academia. So you owe it to yourself to look at opportunities outside of academia. You would be remiss if, if you did not consider being an entrepreneur. The experience changes the way you approach your research, the way you, you approach your work. So you need to develop your abilities, not just scientifically, but also as a leader, ultimately. We have probably the deepest database on deep tech, uh, on the deep tech community in the country. Our participation opened the gates to other investors coming in, and that's significant. <laughs>